a message to EU leaders that may be falling on deaf ears. This protest was planned to coincide with the last day of the EU summit in Brussels. But the 28-member state meeting ended a day early, regardless the protest went on. Their main gripe, a controversial EU trade deal known as TTIP, being hashed out with the US. We're demonstrating as a transatlantic deal will take cheap milk and meat from the United States, low cost compared to us. We have to produce quality milk, quality meat. They inject their cattle to make them produce more, then after two lactations they're dead. If this comes to pass, we really are heading towards bad quality produce. The transatlantic trade and investment partnership will create a single market of 800 million people and could be worth up to 94 billion a year to the EU. But campaigners worry about the impact you competitors would have on key European businesses and institutions. A part of the health profession and I wonder what is health care in the US. I mean there are people there not entitled to care. They have to pay. Everything is privatized. We want people to continue to eat healthy, to heal, to have access not just because they have money, simply because they are citizens and that there is solidarity between people. Farmers and trade unions made up much of the ranks in this protest. Euronews' Effie Gutekosta reports from the demonstration site saying While the leaders of the 28 states have reasserted their commitment to signing the Free Trade Treaty, the farmers, trade unions and representatives of the civil society say they are coming back here in February in larger numbers when a new round of negotiations are set to take place.